I'm gonna surprise my mother. She loves that kind of thing, but it's just really not easy to do or easy to pull off. So here goes nothing. Here's the deal. Today is November 25th, the day before Thanksgiving. My mother thinks that I'm coming in tomorrow because that is the ticket that I bought. I'm supposed to come in Thanksgiving morning and just do that and just chill over then. But what she doesn't know is that I bought a ticket for today. Um, and I'm just gonna walk into the house like I'm supposed to be there and not really say anything, I'm just gonna act like it's normal. The thing is, two people know, and both of those people can't really keep secrets, so I hope that, you know, there's no questions or my name brought up or anything. Uh, but it's gonna be really fun. Taking either a train or a cab, I haven't decided yet. We'll find out together. Um, so yeah, let's go. All right, so decided that we're taking the train because I'm cheap. And I'm always down for an adventure. So this is gonna be how we get to the airport. I've never taken the train or the air train to the airport. So this should be a fun little adventure. I hope this works out the way I want it to. It'll take me about an hour and a half as per my directions application, but I tend to get lost. So I left a little bit early. And then there's also the lines for the airport security and to be completely honest with you TSA tends to stop me quite often for a random pat down and I don't really I don't really have time to miss my flight um, so we're gonna we're gonna do this it's gonna be it's gonna be a real good time if I get to the airport too early I'll just play with the vending machines like I always do my mom called me while I was on the train so I had to answer it. And I kind of told a very small fit, but told I was going on an adventure to take photos, which I'm vlogging right now. I'm on an adventure. It's not a total lie. I'm sure she'll forgive me. The train did not go where it was supposed to go. So I have to go backtrack. It's a good thing I left it early. This is gonna be quite a story to tell actually. So that I'm headed in the right direction because the wallet app on my phone just pulled up my plane ticket stub so I'm somewhere close I'm in the vicinity in the vicinity it's gonna be okay time for the air train Woo. not bad for a seven buck trip eh. I paid 20 extra bucks for more leg room and I got to go through faster than most people so now I'm even more earlier than I was before. No, it was a Perks. There's a bird in this airport. It keeps flying around. I'm gonna try to film it, but it's elusive and it just pops up out of nowhere sometimes. It's kind of freaking me out. See, there's a whole family of birds. A whole family of birds that are just like, hanging out in this airport what's going on man uh, a lot of vloggers i watch don't like film on their travel days and at first i was like oh why not like it's just a right just part of your day why wouldn't you film it and i was like this is boring boarding time walk into my flight gotta get on and do the thing see you soon oh uh, we in here happy thanksgiving she is flying on JetBlue, one of the best See? See, See what I do for you, Mom? <laughs> Thank you. All right, I made it off the flight. It was kind of rough because I hate flying, but we're in Charlotte now. Operation Get to the House is in full effect, and I will see you on the other side of this clip. It's in life that I'm most thankful for is uh, Uber because it's great. Uber is saving me right now. Uber is keeping the surprise alive. <laughs> <laughs> Are you shocked? I am absolutely Are you shocked, shocked. and surprised? What was that? All I right. was worried. I'm calling. I'm going, where is she at? <laughs> 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 I 
Yeah. Were you calling my phone? Yeah. All right. I was FaceTime. I tried to FaceTime you. Okay. And then I called you. And then I just, I said, let me cut her a piece of cornbread. All right. So. I can't take it on. Here's the story of what happened. I was supposed to come in yesterday to surprise you. Okay. But this idiot bought the ticket from Charlotte to New York. So then I had to call the airline and say, hey, that's not what the ticket is supposed to be. And then they were like, okay, fine. So they fixed it for me. So then I buy a ticket. I go to buy a ticket for last night at 510, but it was already 330. And I had to figure out if I could make that from my house. And I could have done it, but I don't like rushing, so it's not cute. So I just bought a ticket for today. Talked to my mom earlier today. Yes, you did. And I was super bummed out. I was in a bad mood for other reasons, but it helped me. And she said, hey, just stay home and relax today because I'm going to see you tomorrow morning. And I was like, yeah, you sure <laughs> will. Flash forward to me trying to get to the airport on the train which was really yeah and it was really great until the train skipped the stop that i needed to get off so i backtrack and i get to where i have to go everything other than that was smooth sailing my mom's gonna love this so when i bought my ticket so the first thing that i bought got refunded to the airline account because I'm a member so I didn't get the, the refund back because that would have took too long so I used that and I figured I'll just pay the difference um when I was buying the new ticket I had the option to buy to the seat that I picked was the best seat and it would cost $20 extra so I was like cool yeah so I was like cool I'm gonna do that little did I know that that extra twenty dollars had me skip check-in. So if you go back to earlier in this vlog, you're gonna see that I left early because TSA likes to pat me down. I put my bag on a conveyor, I put my jacket on a conveyor, and he just let me walk through. And this is my life. This is my life. My mother would be super proud. Mommy, you're super proud that I, I paid that twenty dollars. Very, very proud of you paying that twenty. I and, always pay the extra twenty dollars, and I paid the extra twenty on top of that because I bought airline insurance because you should always yeah. buy airline insurance. Mission accomplished, kids. Yes. I surprised my mom. Yes, you did. Thank you for, for Mother's Day. Me. I didn't think it would happen. Two people knew. One is Fly Dad Rudy. Two is Chuck. Shelly knew. Yes. I'm mad at y'all right now. Here's the thing about Fly Dad, yeah. Rudy, and Chuck. They can keep a secret, but sometimes they slip up. So I was worried this whole time. Mission accomplished. And then I'm trying to reach you because you out on a photo adventure. Right. And oh. I can't reach it. I'm like, dag, man. I just told that girl she accident prone. All right. So backstory. Before every major holiday... I get in yeah. like some sort of injury before yeah. most major holidays. I get some sort of injury. There was when I was five, I got a fish hook stuck in my finger. There was that Christmas where I fell down the stairs. There was a Thanksgiving where I kind of sprained my ankle a little bit. So talk to my mom. As you can see, we're going to revert back earlier into the vlog where I said, Hey, I just spoke to my mom and I told her a little fib cause she called me when I was on the train. When you called me, I was getting off of the train to backtrack to get back to where I needed to go. And I had to figure out how I was gonna how I was gonna explain the fact that there's a train conductor speaking to me as my mother is speaking to me. But the I train the train conductor started talking when my mom put me on hold. <laughs> so that was just luck of the draw. And the only thing I can think of why I would be out of the house on the day before Thanksgiving and the day I'm supposed to fly. I'm very happy to see you. Not to be outdone by her best friend, Patty LaBelle, and her patty pies. Viv has made her own bean pie. Tastes pretty good. 
Just give it a shot. You know, when you hear the words bean pie, I don't think this is what you think of. This is really good. I don't even like pie. I like the top. I like the top a lot. What if you fry it? Fry it bean pie? Like not the crust and everything, just the filling. You fry it and you put some ice cream on top. I don't know. Oh, put it inside of a, what's it called? A dough? And fry it? Yeah, that'll work too. Oh, or I'm thinking more like you get a cupcake pan and put the filling in. It's like a little cup. You can put the ice cream on the inside. I tried. I'm now home. My whiz pulse is back in my life. My bed is back in my life. I'm so tired. Tomorrow's gonna be great. I have rock band now that I didn't have. So I ordered it and I never came down here to get it. I'm gonna do that. Got Cards Against Humanity for the family. It's gonna be a good day. Hope you guys enjoyed me surprising my mom. I know she sure did. So that's really great. Uh, so I'll catch you guys the next time I decide to put up a video because who knows when that's gonna be. Enjoy your holiday.